On the other hand, this might just weaken Prussia. I can just still do it later. Yeah, I think that's what we run off of. Let's go ahead. I don't think these guys exist anywhere here. Okay, we'll cut back on our taxes, but Rich, we're not getting anything from them anyway. When is this war even over? Oh, they're taking, they're taking Prussia. Like, actual Prussia. That's not good. It's not good at all. Oh, I made great power. Pog. So this will secure them this. Which isn't good for me. That means we're going to be at odds with the Polish at this. Which isn't good for either of our sides because I'll probably go over there and kill them. And I'm the only thing keeping Danzig from falling too, so. Okay, I'm gonna just slowly go through my puppets and start getting them ready for me. These guys are good. We'll probably hit these guys next. Then go down to them. Go here, 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 here. the hell is Poland's freaking infamy at? Only 2.25, really. Let's go for that. Hmm. This will give me diplomatic influence. Oh, no. I think we do what Prussia does best. Military. That's what we need right now. Westphalian's military team must get stronger. We will get stronger and more powerful than they ever realized. And then if I can form enough armies, I will get them ready for a war against the Austrians. Yeah, Prussia's done. She's going to fall. Russia's not doing bad. Well, I mean, I guess they're losing the caucus. The caucuses are getting hit. They've made a, they've lost some territory and siege some territory against the Poles. I mean, if the Polish are going to do their war, this is the time to do it. Nobody's strong enough. Nobody can hold their advance. Russia doesn't have the military for it yet, and Russia definitely doesn't either. She has the manpower, but she doesn't have the freaking tech. And fighting another front war against the Ottomans, that's just going to kill them. Personally, if it was me, I'd focus all my troops up here and just crush the Poles and just say, screw the Caucasus. Like, would these mountain provinces be nice to hold in? You need two, three, four, five... Well, actually... Not. Well, you could defend a small... Well, no, you're screwed no matter what. Two, three, four... Five. I'd say... You need six armies to hold down there just to make it... Just to make a stand in the mountains. Which... Tain't doing that. Okay, this gets these guys on my side. That's good. We're going to go for influencing these guys next by doing the same stuff. On hold. And everybody else kind of won't be happy for a while. I'm just going to slowly move my way around. 
That's why I'm going for my army tech now, because if I go for army tech now, I don't have to research it later. And if I don't have to research it later, it means I can kill the Prussians. Especially once this uh, infamy stuff's done, I just let that go over again. Alright, I want all that to be up because I have no guarantee that when I go to Annex, everybody that their stuff's higher than mine. Economy's not doing too bad, at least. Yes. I'm gonna try to keep these. I want these friendly relations with France to continue. She's my, she is my backup. She is my foundation. And then she kill everything for me. Except for these guys. These guys I can't kill. Which means... Strassland and build up the rest of them. Head to Bremen. These guys are going to siege that territory. I know they will. Stud. There we go. It'd be funny those guys take it and then I just can't play the game anymore. This is now German Empire. Good luck. Wait, they're moving into Prussia? What? That kind of funny. What the hell are you guys going to do? You're going to siege down all of this and form Greater Germany? That actually be Pog. I'd be okay with losing just to see the giant German Empire. <laughs> Infamy's coming down still. That's really good. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. My plans are: we got to take Prussia. Russia's doing an okay job. She is fighting back against the Poles, and the Poles are dying now. She has a bigger army. Yeah, I think Russia. I think Russia got lucky and won the war for them. Head up over here, you guys are going to be sending troops into the deaths. Can we increase military spending? Yes, we can. Actually, just had to keel. That's usually where I put most of my stuff at. Increase military spending. Hopefully, that offsets and makes people want to join the army more. You guys are doing fine. Let's do this. Let's do that. Let's see where we're at. Lubex is fine. Let's 
go ahead and try to get these industries going. I want this going hard. I want, I just want these factories starting. There we go, baby. There we go, there we go, the factories are running. This is nice. Yes, yes, get the factories up. Okay. You see everybody's, yeah, it's always free trade with this. I wonder why that stat's like that all the time. Oh. This old bastard returned. Kill them. Make them suffer. Perfect. Head back to kill. Pensionism. Oh, that means me and the French are going to be at odds over that. Of artillery, muzzle loader rifles. Okay, you guys need you guys need those out real quick. Hopefully with the deletion of some of those units, it means the population diffuses back into the military at some point. Oh, give me more. Give me an art factory. Come on, baby. Come on. Yeah, just keep building that. Keep building this industry up. I want it going. So, how much of my population in Hanover is currently? Two hundred twenty-five. I'd like to have about a thousand of those guys. Capitalists are really nice, because then I don't have to spend my own money to get these things going. They're doing their own projects. Oh, there's the famous steel mill, gimme. Steel mill's mine, I want it. Two infantry and a calf. Here we go. Those guys will get rebuilt. I will say the only time I ever feel like I have capitalists that invest is either when I'm playing the United States or when I play like a German state. I don't know why, like, UK doesn't feel, like, none of these other countries it ever feels like they freaking actually invest into my economy. It's probably just me. I, mean, I don't know. It just always feels that way. Like, they don't invest nearly at the same level as I would. Okay, you guys are doing pretty well for yourselves. Good. 0.1%. Alright. I need you to then head to another portion to get another 0.1% if possible. Muscle loaded. Make 
puppet. Russia's army is hurting. I'm improve relations with them. Military access and US. Alright, that's good. Okay, these guys are going up. I'm thinking Hanover. Soldiers. I want to get about 3% of my, my population into the military. Okay, you guys did a fantastic jo job. Let's go ahead and switch down to here. You guys need... Let's do one artillery gun for now. Actually, go ahead and switch that over to that, too. I want bigger portions of my military getting done. Job boys. Okay, that just switched over. Let's go ahead and do this next. Let's keep trying to get three percent. is good. Army's good. Let's go ahead and start getting these boys out. Is that? All right. How does that Callus Bell I last for? 20th of August, 1848. So we have a couple years. That's good. That's really good. Okay, yours just went, did it. Go ahead and switch out of Hanover. Oh good, you're already there. Uh oh. Okay, so.
like to get that calf. That calf would definitely change it. Very least, I'd like to get this infantry out. Go ahead and start funding into this. I'm fine with them using no let's see. Like that, increase this. Kill that. But I don't have any freaking organization either, do they? And I have military tech. Now I just gotta hope France doesn't do anything. Please do not add a war goal. Please do not add a war goal. Victory! We have victory! My boys are doing a terrific job so far. Let's continue on. Yeah, let's stay here. They just push troops there, that'll die instantly. And they did end up losing the east portions of Prussia, or all of Prussia, so that's not good. Just infantry, it should be a kill. French are adding reinforcements. Go, France, go. Okay, we're backing up. My army took severe damage. Um, should end in a victory? I don't know. It's very close. Actually planning on continuing that offensive. Yeah, you guys are back. Hell up. Get the castle now. Alright, we follow back. I'll let the French deal with the rest. Okay, you are not adding all these war goals, you son of a bitch. Okay, I actually might be fine with most of that. Okay, so that gives me a lot of territory to work with. Okay, form the alliance. Form alliance. <laughs> the AI is doing what they shouldn't be doing. Never go into Russia. 
never, never go into Russia. Okay, that stuff's good to go. We got a little bit of industry. Let's go ahead and do ideological thought. I would not be pushing west. You're in Germany, baby. I will swamp you. Arnold's got it. You're good. Good for you, Universal. That was ballsy by France, but they never should have made a push. It's because they got cut off because they accepted a peace treaty. That's their issue. That's good to go. We have more factories. We do. I'm thinking. Hanover already has it. So let's go for clerks. Can you guys give me clerks? I'll build this up if you guys want it. Whatever my industri industrial base wants. What the hell is going on down here? Yeah, I might have to go down there. France should not be in that war still. It keeps sending in more troops in small quantities. What the hell is wrong with them? Keep getting craftsmen, let's keep getting the others in. Let's just build an industrial base. Let's make Westphalia the, the industrial heartland of my empire. All of it. Then the outlying provinces will get annexed soon, and then we can do that to them too. Don't you dare ban me, you son of a bitch. Don't do it. Don't do it. Yeah, you bastard. I go ahead and head over here. Get free trade, because that's always what we do. Um, I'm thinking we carve a portion of Africa out for ourselves. Can we do demand African concession? We could. Could get... Ooh. Dahomey. Point five, baby. Let's see if we get that. I think we get two things out of it. Uh, 
Alright, since we're sending you guys down, you still need your cab. Let's go ahead and get you the cab you are in desperate need of. You guys are missing an infantry troop. Uh, I guess they are still allied with them. That's funny. France, if I was you, I'd just accept the L, because you literally are going to quite take an L. All of you head in here. I need more troops for the fodder. Okay, first army head here. Third and fourth head here. Perfect. Demobilize. Moonbag now. How long is that African concessions ready? About four months. Oh, you know what? I think we went really over on time. I've been having to, I was having too much fun trying to tactically think this out. So this is how I'm seeing it. As of right now, is Westphalia. We're gonna go for state and government. We're gonna keep trying to improve relations with the smaller portions of our empire, and the main goal is to get a full annexation going. We are going to start incorporating portions of the smaller states into the empire, which means I'll have access to, you guessed it, the entirety of my puppets. That is Wittenberg. Here, here, this gives me huge portions of this. This is going to give you this. And more importantly, all of what is Prussia. So we're gonna get two, we're gonna get a large portion, that's over 1.3 million. 1.3 million. That should catapult us to a slightly larger pop. Yeah, that's gonna add, it's gonna add a lot of troops. That's probably almost, I'd say over 2 million. Oh, God. I'd say at least two to three million people are going to get out of the population. And then with that, we can see where we're at. Um, Poland, Lithuania is a possibility we could go after because she's still going to be rather weak. Um, if we can get the industry, if we can get the raw resources, and we can unite, I'm thinking push east. Um, but first, we're going to push down here in West Africa. I actually want to secure portions of West Africa really quickly. Uh, because if we don't secure it now, we never will. Uh, if we sit there and see France has already done a push. Dutch have already done a push. Britain's already got a push. Um, yeah, I want to take what I can. Oh, look, Portuguese, Brazilian, South America. I guess they're going to form Union of Portugal and Brazil. Okay, so that's already been formed. United States could be better, could be worse. Kurdish Canada, Japan's doing nothing. Did Cyan get larger? I think she took Johor. Damn. East Indian Republic looks like it took Nepal. Uh, the little guys over here, Sikkim. Isn't there? And Bhutan. Wow, she went for the smaller portions of the empire. 
Persia took East Af took good portions of Afghanistan. Kara took a small portion of has a small portion of Afghanistan. Latvia and Estonia still got released. Okay, so those are power players for Poland, Lithuania. Since they don't they get cores, they really don't get cores. It's interesting. It's really interesting. Yeah, but I'm thinking that's what we do. With state and government, we will get even more powerful because we're uniting so much of the German provinces under our strength. Um, I'm thinking once that's done, we see where our empire is at at this stage, consolidate, see what we can do. I'm definitely thinking Poland Lithuania is probably the easier of the two to hit. Um, she only ha she has the Ottomans, but the Ottomans are weak, right? 22, that's not very good. Sweden, again, very weak, doesn't have the military it needs to be able to fight. And if France doesn't end our alliance, we have France on our side. And then we can unite. And then if we have enough time, we can sit there and see about hitting the French at some point as well. Because their, their empire is just too big. I can't beat them as is. I'd have to build a huge defensive army, beat them in military tech, and then consolidate a hold through here. The other option is unite the east, the eastern portions of the empire, and then prepare for an all-out invasion westward. It's really another option we have we can play with. Even see about getting an alliance with the UK and using the UK as a possible front. Actually, that probably could work, because what that would do is that would give me UK. That means possible UK Navy. Which has 30 more ships than they do, but smaller army. If they can consolidate their fleet here, then we could probably hurt the French, because the French would pro if, if it was If it's the AI, and it is the AI, they probably would send a big portion of their military to attack the UK. And I can use my fleet to kind of play it, play it with it, where a small portion of their army goes in, kill it, small portion goes in, kill it, small portion in, keep repeating the process. Go in the port, let them cross, small portion comes in, kill, let the UK AI kill it, head back out, bam, entropy, do what we did, but we play it as in the opposite. And then I can do my holdout here in Germany. I just had to probably make a giant army for it. Um, so with that, please like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. We come back, everybody. Westphalia in Vicky 2. I'll see you then. Thanks.